Hello, my loyal subjects, and welcome back to Day Our Billions. Last time we started a glorious Day Our Billions giveaway, so in case you have not entered yet, you can do that in the video in the description down below. Everything will be explained in the video or in the description. And on the other hand, we defended our glorious, glorious city from the first wave, coming from the village of Dim, also known as maybe North. And yeah, it's... Holding surprisingly okay-ish. I'm actually kind of scared because too many things are working out in my favor right now. So yeah, it's kind of weird to be honest, but okay. As far as I can remember, I wanted to seal off this area effectively, so I will need a little bit of additional power around here. That seems fine. We can defend it with one archer that goes here. And this should hold, and after that we will be able to officially build a- Dude! Dude! Dude, dude, shoot him! Dude! Dude! Are you fucking shitting me? Okay. Okay, I- I just accept that, and I understand you're a little bit retarded, and that's just fine. So, um, the attack up here continues non-stop. Um, I'm- Really not sure what I'm supposed to do here, because I can't really defend it in any other way, so... That's bad. Like... Like, really goddamn bad. Ugh, I need more workers, and I need more of- I need more of everything. The infrastructure is going to be important, but... You know what? All these people, they can just live a few days without food, I mean, come on. It's not that complicated, just stop eating! Oh, actually down here we're being attacked, I totally forgot about that. That's why I should not stop in the middle of a recording session. Then things like this happen. So, there are four- Oh, one of them is a promoted one. Eh. Oh, I see the promoted one on here. I will actually- Yeah, let's send a veteran down here and let the veteran help out. I think that would be a good idea. Oh, there are three incoming. That could be a little bit too much for this lone ranger. But don't worry, ranger number one. Ranger number two is going to help you. Yes, ranger number two, your hero. Um, which unit is a veteran? You turned into a veteran, yeah. That's not actually that hard, considering the mass murder that's going on. But I can get one of the veterans down here to help out just a tiny little bit. So, the power is officially here now. So let's get a gate going. I think I will place the gate here. So... It's actually not that bad if it gets destroyed, because there are only two entry points. I think that is, at least for me, surprisingly smart. And, as always, one tower for additional range. So, and the normal ranger, please come here. Then one veteran here. And when this is done, the veteran will hold this gate alone. And this ranger can then help clearing out this part, because we really need the access to some more of that sweet, sweet water. Because water is actually something that is really important for us at the moment, and we do not have enough of it. Ooh, actually up here there's some. Hmm, that could be a very nice place to expand to. Later on. L later on. Don't overdo it. Don't overdo it, Goldie. If you overdo shit, you will fuck up. And if you fuck up, people will die. So don't do that. That's stupid. Uh, we do not have enough workers all together for, um, what is it called again? The workshop, so we can't build farms. That's not all so good, but we are loaded with stone, so we can just stop the production of the quarries for now. That should not be a problem. And instead, build a wood workshop. Can I, can I build it here? Is, this, is there enough space? No, there's not enough space. Of course there's not enough space. There's never enough space. So, this, I think, is an acceptable place, and then we can start building some farms, and with the help of farms we should get the whole food situation under control. And actually... Um, actually, I would like to get some of the zombies to come here. How many are there? Up here there are surprisingly few zombies. Okay, so let's just get them down... Did you seriously not... Come on! You need to see me, I wanna get you here! Get a move on! Fuckers! Okay. So... Now... This... Very... 
very likely actually, was a profoundly stupid idea of myself. Because I got a lot of zombies here and I will most likely die because this is just a wall held by two rangers. So that... Very well be my end because I'm an idiot. But then you it's a veteran. They can do that. Just, just do veteran shit. Be a veteran. You, you know how that works, right? And now just watch this getting completed because we don't have anything other to do. We have something else to do. Bloop. So, um, yeah, they're attacking. But not strong enough as it seems. Yeah, our archers are actually holding them off. Surprisingly enough. So, it seems I'm not that stupid. I'm just... I'm just borderline retarded. So, that's fine. I can live with that. Borderline retarded. It, does, does this count as English? I'm pretty sure borderline retarded does not count as English. At least not as proper English. So... Yeah... Something tells me borderline retarded is wrong. Okay, get farms going. Because food is a big problem on this map. We have a lot of water, but... I just don't have choke points behind the water so I could utilize it fully, so... That's stupid. But, okay. And the Wolves of Doom here blocks this part off, so I can't expand... Expand? 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 Ex ex expand! Efficiently here. So I guess this area will be my expansion slot for now, because I can just clear this out rather easily. And it has grass, meaning I can make foodie foods. Also, I've added center veteran out. The veteran can actually get those enemies in a little bit efficiently. So come on. Get some of those fuckers. Yeah, those is what I want to see. Get all of them. All of them fuckers. Yo, they will now come somewhat fast, slowly-ish, so yay, down and down, good. Just quickly repair that all together and kill all of them, because killing them is important. And there goes my WhatsApp messenger. Hmm, should have turned that off by now. Should have learned that in, what, one and a half year? Yeah, I think somewhere like that, so 1.5 years of making videos on YouTube, I should start to shut down shit I do not need in the backgrounds. But no, no, I'm just stupid like that. Uh, yeah, this seems to be an okay place. Not good, but okay. So we can get some food going, so we can get some more workers going. Actually, the farms do not require workers. This is just weird. But it's okay. It's good enough, and if I place them like this, I can actually get a load of num num out of it. And that's good. At least for now. So, send the lead ranger out again and get some attention, please. It's a huge swarm, but surprisingly enough, none of them seem too interested in actually hunting a fleshy, fleshy blonde right here. Look at how delicious her fights are. You can get a bite just now. Just get you moving right here, zombie dudes. Oh yeah, baby, get those fleshy, fleshy things. Mm -mm -mm. So, and the farms have been completed, now we need energy, which I'm producing right now, come on! Get done! Get done good! Great! And technology research for the ballista is finished too, so... What I wanna do next, um... I'm actually stuck on a shit ton of wood, so let's get cottages going. I think that would be smart, at least in some world. And with that we can actually start doing some effective expandinism. Of course, we then need to defend more down here, but I really need additional workers, and I think I can hold this side. I'm not sure, mind, but I think I can hold it. Let's get one tower going right here, and with that tower we will defend this area. Because two archers should be able to take down all of the standard zombies incoming, and if an executive runs in, then, well, we just lose, but, eh, screw it. South. Shit. Um, yeah, shit defines it. Oh, hello. Are you shitting me? Are you shitting me? Really? 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 Ah, uh, okay. So we can decide between wood and stone, which we both have max, but let's just take wood, I guess, because, well, wood. Okay. 
First of all, we definitely need more energy down here so we can build a second wall layer. But before we do that, we also need a military and one ballista? I think one ballista will actually hold them off just nicely. So yeah, one should do the job. Let's start building it like this. And when a ballista is finished, we should have a finished Tesla tower and therefore a finished second wall. Also, let's just siphon one of our elite archers and one of our standard archers down here to hold this off. And yeah, that should work. I'm pretty sure. Somewhat sure. Marginally sure. I'm not sure at all. Eh, screw it. We will make it. Also, still, I would love some kind of linking between the Tesla towers. It just would just look pretty. Just make it pretty. I want to see it go pretty. Okay. They are incoming now. That's not good, but okay. Let's just do this. We can do this. We already did this before. Remember, remember gals? Okay. The ballister is finished. Hopefully they will hit this part and not... By the way. By the way. Just in case. You know, j just in case they come from here. We, we got a lot of wood, right? So let's use that wood for something. For instance, being woody. Right? You know, it makes no fucking sense. Um, screw it. Let's destroy this thing and instead build a ballista right here. 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 This is good. This, no, this is not good. This is good. This should be good enough to stop whatever is incoming. And yeah. Also, they could come to this gate, which would be fucking terrible, and I just realized. And since the subreddit um, of the Abelians officially told me I'm stupid for saying, well, the pathfinding of the zombies is not broken, it's supposed to be this way because it makes shit more challenging, let's try our best to actually make sure that everything is defended. And I mean everything, the, every way that is possibly reachable from the south now has defenses. Right? Right. So, there's the harpy. Now she's gone. That's good. Actually, it seems she can't jump over double walls, interestingly enough. Should remember that. So yeah. Subreddit, I listen to you. Not like the developers who are not there. So, let's try our best to hold this. Ballista ready? Cocked? Fire! I'm just gonna let this roll and see if I need to intervene, but I think we can hold this. Oh, actually this ballista was an effective investment because it's shooting over there too. That's good. So yeah, the zombie horde is already thinning out, so double walls, smart idea. And ooh, now we have three elite rangers. That's working. Ooh, but the tower is taking damage, interestingly enough. Hopefully the tower will not fall, it would actually incur quite a problem. But eh, uh, I think it's working. Yep, it's definitely working. Let's kill the rest of them and then the shit is done. By the way, you get into this tower so you can clear out whatever comes close. Who is a veteran? <gasps> you turned into a veteran! Smart he's on me's. So, actually they're swarming from everywhere, interestingly enough. Oh, now they're coming from here. Okay, executives, that's a pain. Let's just make sure that there's not a single problem by sending Mr. Shooty Shoots down here. Also, do I have iron? I kind of... No, no, I remember. Iron is down here. I need to expand here if I want iron, which is going to be fucking terrible. Again, fucking terrible. <sighs> so, I guess we will need some more rangers, because we really need to clear out a lot of this map. And we are already on day 20, meaning we don't have that much time left, so... It's going to be a fun one, isn't it? So it seems they're holding just nicely. Ooh, that's a rather big swarm, especially with some executives. I don't like that. Soldier boy, you can go up here and help out there because, yeah, that's actually a lot of them. And since we're only shooting with arrows, that could end badly. Two executives, if I see that correctly. Uh, everything is being attacked, actually, which is also not very good, but hey. Just repair everything for now and wait for shit to go over. Another elite ranger. Great! I like it. I like those leading. Leading is good, good enough at least. So, a lot of shit is getting a lot of shit, but... 
Everything is holding. Nothing is dead yet. Again, surprisingly enough, nothing is dead. And I'm not quite sure if I love that or don't. So that's kind of weird. So the death squad is ready. So let's start clearing out this little piece of shit over here. Ooh, that's actually iron. Ooh. This area seems better and better with every second. Ooh, 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 I like it. By the way, can I finally give... No, I cannot give command chain. So, yeah, still the thing that I would really love. Metrosy is cool, range indicators are awesome, new units, everything great, but a, a, a command chain order is, in my book, something really fucking goddamn important. So, that would be good. If you would, wouldn't mind, because that, that would help a lot. I, I, I personally would say that. So let's build our market here. Because markets are important, because they help you with overflowing resources. Which is something that I, for some odd reason, always have. Ooh. Yeah, I'm just really bad at managing things. I, I don't actually know why I like strategy games that much. I'm really freaking bad at them. I'm bad at managing resources. A bad at micro and macro, I'm I'm just fucking terrible at strategy games altogether. And damn right I don't know my build aura, so yeah, I, I really don't know why. It's kind of weird when I think about it. Possibly I should stop that. Maybe. Ah, uh, doesn't matter. And the kill squad is doing his job really good. Do you get some XP, by the way? Nah, yeah, you're not that good because, of course, the veterans get the most kills, but... Uh, just just make it so. Also, another thing I would love to see, and it's actually not getting kill XP, but, but also getting kill XP, but in an aura. So, that if you kill someone, they would give one experience point divided by the number of units nearby to every unit. So, that would kind of make it possible to level with veterans but slower, because veterans would get the experience point, but they would not use it in any way because they are already veterans. So I think that would be cool, maybe. Under specific circumstances, that would be amazing. So the clear out is working, so let's advance our energy network a bit further and see where we can block off this hellhole. This actually looks amazing when you look at it from above. It's just those Poor rangers killing endless hordes of zombies all rushing towards them or shambling depending on the kind of zombie, but still. It just looks really cool, but none of them get close enough to actually deal damage. Well, now they will because of the executive, but still. It just looks really mighty fine. Ah, do you remember the Kong... what was it? Command and Conquer Generals, I think it was. Uh, intro theme. There was this plaza being defended by the... What was it? WA? I think it was the WA. And all around them were those... Uh, global... Whatever they were. Global, global... Global... Not GDI. GDI is from another common man and I, I can't remember. The green ones, okay? The green ones, and they were constantly attacking them. But the scene was scripted that way that... Uh, um, units would not take enough damage, so they would die, and they would regen quickly enough for it to go on forever. So it was an endless onslaught, going and going, and oh, I loved that as I was... How old was I? Eight? Nine? I watched my father play it, because I wasn't allowed to play it, and I loved it. Oh, it looked so gorgeous, and I tried to recreate it in the game when my father was asleep, but I just couldn't, because of course units don't regenerate in the game, because they're tanks, and tanks... Most of the time, don't grow back. Yeah. Weird story. Hello. <laughs> I'm weird. Hope you like me. The clear out is going excellent. So, while we're doing that, let's upgrade some more houses quickly at that. Because if we have all of those houses at the next stage, that means we will be able to get a shit freaking ton of workers. And that's literally the most important part, right? Oh, the kill squad lost one ranger. Uh, that's bad. But, yeah, we got some really fast ones, and a lot of them at that, so let's kill them, if possible. Thank you. And back, because there's an executive. And, yeah, we're back in business. Okay, that worked. That's the most important part, right? And we got a new ranger down here. Great, great, great. Thank you. 
And another one. Ooh, four elite rangers now covering this gate. Excellent, excellent. And the sniper training is officially being completed. The reason why I want snipers, by the way, is exactly for shit like this. Just one sniper in the tower can just remove the executive before it becomes a problem. Instead of not so beautiful moments where this can happen. So, the ballista is holding this nicely. And up here, I think we should be able to... Come on. Yeah, here, just power up here. One elite ranger stationed here to howl off anything that wants to kill us. And you can start clearing out the top part here a bit. Because this seems to be a choke I can defend somewhat well. And this is of course defendable and here we can just build two towers which will hold this. How are the walls holding up? Ooh, there's actually a lot of them incoming. This is not good. Not good at all. I do not like that. Please remove them as quickly as possible. Thank you. And yeah, one of our snipers definitely... Uh, in this tower or would I like to build actually... I think I will build him a second tower right here. So he has a clear line of sight to this area. Actually, I think I will send the second sniper up there too. Yeah, I think I'll need that. Okay. Now that this is holding, great. Get more energy here and defend it but of course and send another lead ranger up here to hold this place and we have efficiently expanded great and this area will of course cover fruit production and the like while we're at the theme of fruit production we should use that food to grow quickly very quickly because we need more gold because 400 per 8 hours is definitely not freaking enough. So two snipers in there should do the job. Let's produce some more snipers for here. And who became a veteran? You became a veteran. So you got a replacement veteran. Oh, that's great. So. Oh, okay, from the south again. Not good. But doable. Manageable, I would rather say. So, what will they do here? If they come from the south again, they will most likely hit this wall. And it's effectively good defended. Not perfect mind, but good enough, really. I need a bit of energy for a second tower. I think I will just deactivate this in order to get that. Oh, I can't because the ballista is too close. Oh, that's stupid on my part. Oh, Jesus Christ almighty. Uh, yeah, then. Remove that here. So, and there. Yeah, this seems good. This is a very good plan. So, of course, they will attack every other gate too, which is bad. But I think I will manage. Also, stone. We really don't need the stone right now, so sell that off so I can get a bit of gold going. Because I want this wall here, especially this wall here, to be better defended. So, let's build an energy tower here and then instantly charge the next line of wallage. Which I got because I don't have wood, I forgot. Well, shit. Okay, so... Okay, this is a way through, so there's just more zombie hordes incoming. That's not good. Will not hold that effectively. Effectively? Effectively. What I can do on the other end is tower here and... Just send them like this. Yeah, this is good enough. Actually, one of them extra here. So, where's the sniper that I just produced? I hear you shout, sniper is ready. There. Um, where is your point going to? Here. You're here. Okay, so one sniper in this building. Thank you. One sniper in this building. Thank you. And with that, we should be able to hold off the, well, biggest problems in zombie history. Okay, they're coming from down there, so they will most likely hit here and here. Good. Good to know. Information is very important in this game. And the game does really not give two flying fucks if you get it or not. Oh wait, no no no, that's actually really freaking stupid because this thing cannot shoot over mountains. I totally forgot, so here would be a vastly better position for the second ballista tower on this part because most likely the horde will split up. Well, I think they will split up because of this beautiful thing here, which I will not call a river for fuck's sake, but still. 
Ooh, it's not a bullet to the brain, bitch. Um, yeah. <laughs> this could be a problem. I'm not quite sure yet, but it could. And the fact that it could turn into a problem is already a reason for me to not like it a lot. So, all of you in here, in case they send a small wave in after this one, just so you won't die. And, of course, here we will now see the wave incoming in a second there. Come on. Yeah, of course. Okay, by the way, they're far enough away for me to... Yeah, build the inner wall. That's important. It's really good that I just thought about this. This will slow them down significantly before they can attack the Ballista Tower. So, let's chuck them away, boys. Yeah, the side tower is helping out too. Great, great, great. This is good. And surprisingly enough, they're actually not splitting up as it seems, so... I can just focus my defenses from south attacks on this position. That's... okay-ish. And yeah, that... went by... really easy. Nice! Very well done! Very well done! Excellent! So again, just send you into the towers in case they send some troops after. Because they most likely do. Let's just face it. Yes, clear, clear. Huh. Nothing, actually. Ah, oh, yeah, there are some some stragglers incoming, but the sniper will take care of them and to level up, and elite snipers are the shit. So, that's good. So, let's continue with my plan of making excellent expenditure by clearing this area out. We really need the place... The place? The area? The, the building area! So, this is the correct word. And we are not getting it at this speed is something that I do not like. Also, I definitely need more energy. I'm I'm such an industrial state. This is terrible. I just it's just all of my problems come down to one thing. Do my people eat enough to work? And do you work enough to do shit? And now we have the third problem. Do you have enough energy to work so you can eat? This is uh, I don't like it. I really don't like this problem. Actually, I have not found a single resource stockpile until now, which is something I don't like, but just wanted to put that out there. Usually you find one or two of them in the early game somewhere close to your colony, but this time I literally found none, which is weird to say the least. So the millage got completed, so what do we need? We need wood and stone for our beautiful warehouse. Let's. Pump this quarry up again, so we get some more stone, and wait it out! Oh, our soldiers up here are in trouble, that's not good, come on. Don't go too far, okay? Going too far is a bad thing to do right now. Oh, this is holding... This is holding too... Everything is holding just fine. I, I, I really enjoy this. And after I've cleared this area out, I will actually... Oh shit! Uh, mind you, don't hit that. Thank you. Um, I think I will send those troops quickly down here. Oh shit, they hit it. Oh shit, they hit it. Okay, back, 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 back. Just go into the tower so you'll survive this onslaught and just let him hit that energy thing. I really do not need it right now. Okay, everything is like now the after horde seems to be hitting, but luckily enough the snipers and archers and all the other doodle doos are doing a really good job at... Oh, but the infection is spreading? Oh, no, no, okay, it's just here. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus, I'm all scared right now. Woo. Oh, my heart. My poor, poor heart. Don't do this to me. So, the stone workshop. Um, I cannot place it anywhere here, right? Oh, I can place it here. That, that's great that it fits there. Because it's right next to stone, you get it? Um, okay. So, yeah. Just constantly push the repair button whenever it's available to repair shit, and this should be nice. Anywhere else we get attacked and have problems? No, not really. Everything's holding okay-ish. Yeah, this thing is nearly busted, but that would not have been a problem because we have a second wall, so... Yeah, that's good. There are some attack, but let's face it, this will work out, and here... See, anybody else? Do the guns of those soldiers kind of sound like BB guns. Because if they're using BB guns, then I know why we failed in surviving in the first place. Oh, that's a lot of them. Oh, that's a lot of them. Please focus the higher health targets for now, because you're snipers and that's your job. 
Just forgot forgot to mention that. And of course, repair everything, please. Come on, repair shit. You can do it. I'm proud of you. What is she getting repaired? Oh, the gate got some hiddles in. Well, it's not good. And this thing here, of course. But yeah, I can repair, so that's fine. Uh, the snipers will draw a lot of attention. That's not too good, but yeah, what can you do? But we have some wood over. And over wood means we can upgrade our houses, which is important and will always be important. So just keep doing what snipers do and kill people that do shittle. Actually, I will produce some troops for you to help you with that. Don't worry, they're free of charge. So, first one done, come on, in the tower of you. This is the same problem as before. The shooting attracts more zombies, but I cannot afford to get the shooters away because I need the shooty shoots to make sure that the big ones don't come in and will crush my ass. That's not good. But hey, who cares, right? So, by the way, now that the wave attack is over, send the archers down here again. Just so we can clear this whole thing out. Ooh, infected colonist! Ah, oh, such a beautiful lady. Good night. So, gun. Let's repair this thing. And when it is repaired, we can go down here, build a wall here, build a wall here, and then push forward here, build a wall here, remove this mall, and bam. We have a lot of additional space secured. And this thing here is just, just this weird holdout with pew pew and arrows and shit. It's really weird. Oh, veteran sniper, there we have him. Look at that beauty with his greenish shittles. So, yeah, I um, pumped some shit towards the developers for just putting over a gold layer over the unit, but they proved me wrong with the sniper, they can also layer them blue. It's not that much better in my opinion, but, well, I guess it's fine. But still, I would love to see something else. Personally, just just make them a little bit different. You don't have to well shittle out a giant awesome thing magic or something like that, but something. Just just something that would be cool. Why is the mill down here blue? I'm pretty sure the mill is not supposed to be blue. I could be wrong, but the mill is blue. And that's not the mill I work with usually, so that's weird. Okay. Let's uh, research, I think, stone houses for now. Because, again, we don't have that much place. And, yeah, we need to work with what we got, right? That's not too good. But again, we will manage because we are freaking amazing. And this thing is building up nicely, so we will have the defenses going in no time. Actually, just start clearing them out, why not? Go on, gotta move on. I also really like that the snipers are no longer targeting one unit, and if somebody kills it before they shoot, they will just shoot in the empty air. That's a bug that was in, I think, V.3? Um, V3.0, so. But I'm not quite sure when they fix it, I just realized it now. But it's good. The fact that this is gone is very important. Also, while we're at it, build shit! Because shit makes people happy. So now that we have this beautiful open grassland here, we can start... Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that food. Mmm. This is good. Oh, this is a lot of food. This alone will help us... Build a city gigantic. Oh, another veteran sniper? Who? You? Yeah. Okay, two veterans here. This should make things rather easy because look at the rate they're firing. Uh, I think they're firing about one bullet a second or something like that. Or I think 1.5, something like that. I can't really look it up because I would have to put them out of the tower and I don't want to do that, but just something like that, right? Okay. Our forces are not really in danger. That's okay. I can work with that. And stone houses have officially been researched. So the second this food is done, I will upgrade this tent. Go on. And upgrade all of those two sto- Not all of those, one. I will upgrade one 
to a stone house. I will upgrade one stone house, one for everyone. <laughs> well, this sniper is on 30% experience, so that's okay. He will level somewhat quickly. And you will just hold this line so the sniper can get some experience because I want this sniper to be an elite place. Yeah, they're no longer coming in. They're trying to, but they're getting fucked, so that's good. Oh, that's not good, mind. Retreat a bit. Retreat towards a ballista, actually. Yeah, let the ballista handle that. And good night. I would actually love a target priority farthest away for the snipers. That would actually be pretty good when you have a squad of rangers behind him that uh, keep the near ones dead so they can uh, directly target the enemies behind them. That would, I think at least, justify a lot. I mean, in game design choices, thing which, so it would be justified to make this thing into the game because it would be used. I'm stupid, okay? Just, just live a bit. I'm not a smart person. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Look at all that food and bam. Shit's gone. And um, why can't I upgrade more? Oh, I need energy. I forgot I need a shit ton of energy for that. Ugh. I remember why people told me to only build tents because tents are energy efficient. Oh. Well, I'm late to that train. Shit. <laughs> oh, that's bad. Oh, there's a lot of them. Wes. This is... This is a weird one, the West, because I have average defense here. And if they're approaching from the West, they could hit here, here, here. They could come from the northwest finger magic and could hit here. So this is kind of weird. Also, I don't have a lot of defenses in this particular place. So, uh, what do we do? What do we do? What will we do? First of all, let's sell a little bit of stonage so we get to 1k. Great, so we have 1k gold lying around. That means we can build two ballistas. Very important, in my book at least. So, uh, here? No, because if the gate falls, they can attack it. Don't build it here. Build it here. And then one here, I think. I don't have enough what? Energy, of course I don't have enough energy. I never have enough energy, game. Fuck off. Um, can I stop... No, I cannot stop the farms producing, actually. But I can stop producing stone for now. I know stone would be good, but currently I think living is more important. Personally. Just the thing in my head. So yeah, here, this will hold, and let's get into the fact that we still don't have gold because I'm an idiot. The colony is being attacked where? Okay, it was just a, a stupid tower. That's fine. Just make the tower go way, way. That's fine, I don't need it. Yeah, this is more important. Just hold everything. Just diddly doom fine. Also, one tower here for you, darling. So you can hold them off better. Okay, when those towers are done, this should be a pretty good defensive position. But of course, now that we have gold, we will still reinforce it quite a lot by building another wall layer here. We can replace it later on with a gate, if we so desire. But for now, I think this is the most likely place they will hit. No, it's this one. They will hit down here. Well, that's shit. Um, that's, that's a real big bunch of shittily diddly tits. Oh, sugar tits. Okay, come on, what can I do? First of all, won't need stone. Get rid of the freaking stone. Ugh, what is expensive? I don't like it. Ugh, this is disgusting. Um. Okay. First of all, rotation of units. Very important. Rotate a lot of units. Whatever you can get, actually. Wherever I have a unit that's spare, rotate it over here. <laughs> that was weird, but okay. Um, yeah. A sniper and an archer should hold the... No, actually, they will not hold it. They have a big problem right there. Oh, that's bad. But here, I can send this whole squad down there. You go back there. You need to be down there. But the snipers are definitely needed here. Because... Ooh, shitties. That's a lot of them. Ooh, that's already a lot of them. And they're going to get more than... Ah, shit. Okay. 
Uh, tower costs wood. Don't have wood. When wood come, please. There wood. Thank you, wood. So, a tower here. I guess. We, we will have to defend this with uh, tooth and tail. So, that's not all that goody. So, just build walls. Build, build lots of them. Build many walls. Maybe we will survive. Maybe not. And I can't afford another uh, ballista, which I really don't like. And if really don't like, I mean really freaking don't like. Oh, I have gold. I have gold. I can buy wood. Wood, wood, wood. Wood. That should be enough wood, I think. One more tower here. Just hold it off. That's all you need to do. And... I have seven. That's not a lot. What do you mean? Uh, oh shit, how much? Oh, they cost three. Oh, I thought I could build seven walls of that. Oh, oh I'm stupid. I'm so freaking stupid right now. <laughs> okay. Okay. Stakes will not help us here. Not a lot at least. So, build more walls. They will come from the west. So, build more walls. Please, please, thank you. Okay. By the way, I just sent you in here. Just go down there and start doing shit. Ugh. That's not good whatso freaking ever. Oh yeah. Oh fuck, that's a lot of them. Okay, fuck my life. Um, Just remove one wall here and send all those archers here too. We need every helping gun hand what the fuck ever is available down here. Do we have... Okay, we can we have some archers over that can help out. One, two, one, two. So, well, that's really all I can afford to send over here because I need to hold the other sides too in case something happens, right? Okay, all the snipers up on this tower right now. Come on, get get good or go home. All those archers here, g go down here. Just so you have the right to attack. Oh, they're already close. Oh, they're already close. Oh, they're already close. Oh, they're close. Everybody attack. Swarm and attack. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yeah, the veteran is not going to help you that much. Well, I let you know about that. Okay. Still, okay, the tower is nearly done for, so this is bad. Um. Okay, think for a second here. Think. This will take a time, but when it's done, we will have a situation to fall back to. Because the farms will most likely get overrun, let's face it. Um, can I place it somewhere farther? I can place it here. That would save the buildings. Do it. Gold. I cannot get any gold at all at the moment. Okay, screw it. I need to remove one of you. Screw you. Bam. So, how much is Woodworth? Ah, oh, it's exactly it's gold. Ah, oh, it's shitty, but I need one of those here because there's some going to attack. Oh shit, shit, sugar tits. A mill will give me some gold. Okay, I have 500. Great, that's all I need. Bam. And another one of those pretties here. That would be enough range between them, but I would like to give them support fire, so I would have them to place here. But if they crush my defenses too fast and kill all the units, because I'm planning on losing a lot of units right now, I will use meat shields to stop the zombie horde. Oh. Mm. I don't like this. I don't like this. I will have to get some distance between them. Here would be fine, I guess. And... Everybody who's on the floor, just go here and stop them when they come through. Yeah, those those snipers are dead, mate. Come on, they're gonna come behind. Strongest enemy, you target them. And now, bam, body block them. Body block them. Body block all of them. Just stop it until the ballista towers are ready. You're halfway there. Come on, guys, you can do it. Uh, you're not even no no this this no this is this is not going to work is it no no this is this is definitely not going to work oh shit ah fuck ah oh, okay no this is no this is, oh this is a nightmare oh this is shitty tits ah oh, fuck do we have any units somewhere left no only units that are actually dying so 
Yeah, I don't think the tower will be ready in time. Especially not for a big horde like this. Yeah. This seems like a big no-no. <laughs> yeah, no, no, this is... This was wishful thinking. But I fucked this up. I should have destroyed the ballista towers here the second I realized they were coming from down here and just planted ballista towers here. No, yeah, same problem as always. Yeah, I'm just not good at strategy games, am I? Well, but maybe you are better than me and therefore I would like to remind you of the little giveaway going on. Again, the link to the video will be down in the description. It is explained perfectly to you, and on Friday the winner will be chosen randomly. So, go there, have fun, and with a bit of luck you will have the billions in your game collection by then. So, I hope you had a great day, I wish you a golden night, and until next time everybody, bye bye!